Hi everyone and welcome back to another what I eat in a day video where I take you through my whole day and I show you everything I ate in one day. I started my day off with some sweet banana ice cream. Into the food processor goes frozen bananas, one large date, your superfoods green powder, some spinach, and some vanilla extract, which I forgot to show. Now blend it all up and it becomes this sweet, creamy, green goodness. And what a shocker, I actually decided to use um, a bowl instead of a large mug. I piled all my ice cream into this wooden bowl. And for my toppings, I added some ground flax seeds and then some frozen raspberries. This was very quick and easy to make. It was very sweet and delicious and trust me, you do not taste the greens at all. So you're just packing in some extra nutrients and honestly, it's so satisfying and delicious. Moving on to lunch, I was so ready for my serving of chocolate of the day, so I decided to make my double chocolate chunk cookie dough. I will leave the link to the recipe right here on the screen and down below. So essentially, I just made my cookie dough and I excluded the dark chocolate on the top of it. And then I paired it with one chopped apple and about half of a large chopped cucumber. And I used the apple and the cucumber as dips for the cookie dough. I can definitely see this becoming one of my next go-to quick and easy meal ideas because it was very easy, very delicious, very quick, and very filling as well, considering all of the beans within this chocolate cookie dough. It's packed full of nutrients. I highly recommend you try this out. For my last meal of the day, I was ready for something savory. So I had my Japanese sweet potatoes. I washed and cut them into chunks. And then I decided to cut them into potato fries or potato chips, whatever you want to call them. It was a little bit difficult, but it was definitely worth it because they crisped up a little bit more than they normally would in the oven baked whole. I then put them on a tray lined with parchment paper and I sprinkled them with some cinnamon powder. And then I popped them into the oven to bake for about 40 minutes at 225 degrees Celsius. I also wanted a very large savory salad to go with my chips, so I chopped up about half of a head of iceberg lettuce and I put that into a large bowl. And then into my microwave safe container, I put in some frozen peas, some frozen corn, and also some frozen carrots. And then I pop that into the microwave for about six minutes until it's cooked fully. Once the veggies are cooked, I just dump it over top of the lettuce and I give it a good stir. And then I just sprinkle it with some regular mustard. I absolutely love mustard as a dressing. It pairs so well. So this is the final result. I just have my huge plate of baked Japanese sweet potato chips and then a big savory salad with all of my veggies and all of my nutrients. That's everything that I ate in a day. If you guys liked it, give me a thumbs up. And if you're new here, subscribe for more. I will see you next time.